How's it going, my fellow collectors? This is Link Reviews, and I am Link, and today, from you guessed it from the thumbnail, I am going over two 10-inch Target-exclusive Pokemon Mewtwo Funko Pops. Now, the reason why I bought two is one of the part of this video is going to be partially for my other channel, which is Link's Poke Packs. You see, in some of the Mewtwo's, there's a Pokeball inside the head. Now you see why I bought two. Because if I hear a jingle in one, that one's getting cracked open. So, let's get right to the opening, shall we? Or, let's see the box. So this is part of a set of 10-inch Funko Pops. You can get the potential of the Pichu, the Vulpix, the Mewtwo, and the Mr. Mime, which is absolutely spectacular amazing. I don't think they have a Pichu one of the 10-inch, but they do have a Vulpix and a Mr. Mime. This is just so cool. So let's get right to it. It's also going to go towards my 10-inch Pokemon collection. So let's get open with the first one and then the second one. And if I don't hear a jingle out of either either one, I can always just return it. Because I don't need two of the same time. No shake in this one. Although it does come with a detachable base, which is strange. I have not seen that before. Although, will this even line up? That's flipping crazy. It doesn't even line up. does it and I'm just being an idiot. That's crazy. This thing doesn't even want to go into the holes. Did they actually measure this at all? They bother to measure this at all. Seriously. I'm going to have to work at these individually just to get it in. There's one hole. Well, that one fits in that one. That's insane. Sorry, this is taking so long. Well, we got it, at the very least. That's number one. Let's get to the second one, shall we? Also, with Funko Pops, I guess you gotta be very aware that the bases, uh, pegs might not line up with the peg holes. Which is ridiculous. Am I going to have to do the same thing with this one as the other one?
I got it. Quicker because I learned from my mistakes. So here is the first one. I didn't hear a jingle from either one, so probably after this video, I might Google a way to know for sure if they have Pokeballs in their head. If not, this is also a good way to see uh, like differences between production quality, and also I can just return the one that's worse off. I know that's bad. What can I say? I don't want to spend unnecessarily 30 bucks. Although, technically, I didn't... Actually, no. I got one of these for free. I forgot. I bought this on the deal on Target.com, the Disfunko Pop deal where you buy one, you get one free. So technically I got one completely free, so I might as well just keep it. So here we have the Mewtwo from Pokemon, Funko Pop, and there is, I can already see, some differences in the uh, production quality, especially on the tail on this one, the ridge on his tail is a lot higher and there's some scratches right here. This one is not, this one is a little bit scratched on there. Other besides than that, it looks pretty much the same. There's no scratches on the scalp, although... Yeah, this one it seems to be the one that's worse off condition compared to this one. So one of them is like really nice condition. The other one has got some few... Uh, imperfections but all in all it's actually pretty cool I'll probably take some pictures of the differences of the production quality and post them sometime in the video but other than that this looks actually pretty cool I'm glad I bought this pop I know this was a bit of a shorter video and I know this was a bit different seems kind of rushed but that's just because I wanted to see if I could hear a jingle from inside their heads which I can't so I'm guessing I may accidentally just I may just uh, crack this one open anyways and see if there is in there. Although, who knows, I might just keep it. This might be a video from my other channel. It might not be. But all in all, this is a pretty cool pop. I'm super glad I got it. It's one of the reasons why I got two of them. I didn't want to just destroy one and then not have it. So I'm really lucky at the time that I was thinking of it that Target had the deal where you buy one and get one free. Especially since... I, when I first started seeing these videos of people cracking the Mewtwo's open, saying they had Pokeballs, I was like, why would you do that? Why would you wreck a perfectly good Funko Pop? You know what? The more I got thinking about it, and then when I saw this deal, I was like, oh yeah, I gotta try this. This leaves like a perfectly good chance. I buy one Pop, get one completely free. So thank you, Target, and your epic deals. Also, guys... We just reached 166 subscribers. We're almost a quarter of our way to the uh, to the 250, which would be a quarter of the way to uh, halfway to 500 subscribers this year. A chance to uh, to win a child Funko Pop that I have an extra of. So it's pretty cool. So I want to thank you again for those um, 500 subscribers or not 500, 166 subscribers. Also, the reason why I haven't been doing many Funko Pop videos lately. As you've sure have noticed, because I was doing them for a while, is because I haven't seen any really that I actually really want. But don't worry, I have a lot of them pre-ordered. I have a bunch of Marvel ones from Marvel Contest of Champions. Um, I have uh, a whole line of Deadpool ones. I also have all of the Godzilla vs. King Kong Funko Pops on pre-order besides the two 10-inch ones. So that's going to be really epic when those come out. So I'm super excited for those. So yeah, that's it for this video. I would recommend you buying this one, and if you ever get a chance to buy two of them, maybe you want to try it as well. As always, my fellow collectors, like, leave a like, subscribe, share this video with your friends, and as always, have a nice day, and peace out. So I learned, guys, that there is no Pokeball inside their heads. It's all fake. You know, I really thought... I really thought I'm I really thought there might be a Pokeball inside of one of these. And then I Googled. And then I turned out uh, that it was all fake. This goes to show you do some more research. So I got two free pops out of it, two of the same pops. Maybe I'll add uh, one of these to the five hundred subscriber giveaway as well. Although I don't think so because I don't I, I wouldn't give up the perfectly pristine one and I don't want someone to have one that has obvious imperfections, so I might just keep it. I mean, I've got two Mewtwo's. Who could say that? Anyway, guys, have a nice day. Peace out.